How's it going everybody? Please disregard my long facial hair. It's been a long week, but today I just want to talk to you guys about what the title is about. And this involves my 2004 Mustang GT. Now, a couple days ago, I started hearing this noise coming from my clutch. Um, it wasn't that loud. It was it was minimal, but I could still hear it. And um, throughout the week, as I was going to school, uh, this sound started getting louder and louder and louder until about yesterday where I turned my car on, I started getting ready to go to school, and then the noise was just incredible. It sounded like something was about to explode in a million pieces. Now, at this point, I knew there was something wrong, so I immediately started to do my research on what this noise could be. And uh, I contacted uh, my mechanic as well, and uh, we diagnosed the problem. Now, right now, I will turn the car on, and I will show you what this noise is, and then we will talk a little bit about um, what I will be doing in regards to this problem. So, this is what the noise sounds like. I will turn my car on, and uh, without pressing the clutch, and then I will press the clutch, and you, we, you guys will know the difference. Hopefully this helps you if you're going through this problem. So let me demonstrate for you guys. So as you guys could tell, the noise is just horrendous. I literally cannot explain it in any other words. Um, it is just probably the worst sound I've ever heard in my life. But um, the part that I want to let you guys know is what to do with this problem. Now, with my research and talking to my mechanic, we came down to two possible explanations for this noise being the throw out bearing or the pilot bearing. Now these are two things that uh, consist in, with the clutch and that will make this kind of noise. Now what I decided to do is to just buy a complete clutch kit. Now I'm not saying go buy it from this place because they're not sponsoring me or whatsoever. I just bought it from this place which was American Muscle. They had the stage one clutch kit for my 2004 Mustang. Now this included the pressure plate, the clutch, the alignment tool, and of course the pilot bearing and the throw out bearing. So always remember if you're gonna buy a clutch kit, um, read in the description and make sure that it comes with the pilot bearing and the throw out bearing. Now money wise, uh, this was around $200 for me. Now talking about the mechanical work uh, being done to it, it'll be around $250. Now, I know this mechanic, it's a good friend, he's been doing a lot of our cars. I'm thinking that's why the prize is $250, but let's just put it around that. So around $450 to remove the transmission, put all the parts back in, and reinstall the transmission. So, Yes, guys, this will hurt a lot. Um, it's, a, it's a lot of money to do this, but hey, I can't complain. The car uh, has been running perfect for the three years now that I've owned it. I can't complain. And um, it, it was about time. This, this, this was about time past due for a whole clutch kit done to this car. So... I mean, I guess now I could say I'm I'm finally upgrading this car. I mean, I'm I'm kind of doing it, um, force forcefully, but at least 
something good will come out of this. But I just wanted you guys to know a little bit about what's going on. I wanted to update you guys. And then I hope you enjoyed. If you learned anything, please leave a like on this video. Subscribe for more videos, guys. And stay tuned because I will get the car fixed up in a matter of days. Now, hope you have a wonderful day. And I'll see you guys in the next video.